So this year Saltwood have introduced a new range of products, the telescopic crawler cranes. Yes. And we have the baby one behind us. So tell me a little bit about this. And okay, uh, this is our new product, somewhat telescopic crawler crane, mm -hmm. five tons, which means the maximum lifting capacity is five tons. Okay, and what? How high can this lift? The highest uh, uh, lifting range is 60 meters. 60 meters. Yeah. Yes. Okay. And uh, for this kind of machine, maybe I can give you a brief introduction. Yeah, please do. Okay. Uh, for this one. It equipped, equipped with the Yangma engine with uh -huh. Euro 5 emission standards. So it will meet all the certification for the European market from an emissions point of view. Yeah? Yes, we already okay, got cool. the CE certification and wow, we already great. have the sales to the UK. Uh -huh. And this is a, this product is mainly designed for European market. Yes, yes. And uh, if you look at this kind of the machine, you can you can see that it equipped with a blade, so it, it can be also uh, provided the supporting. Uh huh. Yes. Oh, so, so you could push earth, and it's also a support for when you're lifting the maximum yes, weight. Yes, of course. And I see this has got steel tracks on. Is this also available in rubber tracks? Yes, this is our standard configuration. And also, you can also have the rubber track for as option uh -huh. for adapt the more like walking situation. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yes. And if you look at the tent table. This, this is a very with advanced technology and it can be very easy to interchangeable and also very easy to maintain it. Okay, so it's a, it's a good machine to have from a maintenance point yes. of view. Yes, and for the protect the operators like in the cafe, you can see that we already equipped with the uh, window shield. Oh yeah, so this is to protect the, the operator, yeah? Yes. From rocks coming or something falling or if the swings into his... Yes. His, yeah, that's, that's really good from a safety point of view. Yes. And we already have this kind of, a lot of the sales to the European and this is our like star products. Oh, that's great, yeah. But this is the baby one of the range. Yes. So shall we go and have a look at some of the bigger ones? Of course, no problem. Uh -huh. Let's go this way. Okay. Okay, uh, this is uh, the 55, somewhat telescopic crawler, cro okay. 55 tons. Uh, is this the biggest one? Actually not, we have the bigger one, like the 75 tons. Oh, okay, so this yes. is 55, right? This is 55 okay. tons. So tell me a little bit about this one. Okay. I can see some things here tell me what what these are okay uh, for this kind of screen which means the maximum lifting capacity is 55 toner that's pretty and, long and uh, yeah. if you look at the uh, check shoe this one is, can be like a uh, extra and uh, and the uh, inside which means they can have the more powerful like a uh, more stable uh -huh. while you lifting the materials and for this kind of the machine mainly used in the construction side it okay. works together with our drilling rig and also lifting the other material, construction materials uh -huh. in uh, construction site. And tell me the advantage of this as opposed to a truck crane. Why is this better than a truck crane? As you can see, this is a this, uh, telescopic crawler crane. It has the combination of the large screen and also the truck crane. Uh -huh. Yes, compared with the truck crane, it can travel in with load. Which means this is very important ah, in the okay. construction site. Yes. Yes, and uh, compared with the large screen, because this one has telescopic boom, so it, it, it can like very easy to mobilization. Uh huh. And and you would move this around on a low loader, would you, from yeah. one site to another? Yeah, this is very important for yes, customers. Yes, yes. And also, I see that this, this can go on a construction site which is very muddy. Yes. Whereas a truck crane wouldn't be able to, to, to do that, right? Because yes. it just gets stuck. Yes, because yeah. sometimes the, the construction site is very like a not good condition. So with uh -huh. this kind of the bed, it can be very easy to travel in. Yes, no, no, we are not sink. Okay, and I also notice on this the tracks are quite wide apart. Is that because of a stability? Um, so it makes it very stable. Yes. Ah, uh, normally okay. the, the, the cranes they can like be extract to make the lifting more stable during uh -huh. the operation. Cool, yeah, that's great. Yes, and this machine also equipped Cummins 3 engine with, with uh, standard 3 emission, and it's a very powerful engine and with uh -huh. good service. So these, these bigger models also conform to all the European standards? Yes, for this one, I think currently we cannot sell to Europe, but mainly in China, Yes. Okay, but they, they are environmentally friendly engines, right? Of course. And, yes. and also efficient? Yes. Okay. 
Oh, okay. That's really good. And uh, so the one here, the, the SWTC30, is very similar, but just a smaller capacity. Yeah, this is almost oh, okay. the same, but with the maximum lifting capacity is 30 tons. Uh -huh. uh, this is also with uh, Kami's engine, and the maximum lifting <laughs> height is 42 meters. Okay, well, it's pretty high. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, thank you very much for telling me about, about your new telescopic cranes. They're very impressive. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, see you next time. Of course. See you. Thank you.